Welcome to the NJIT website and math podcast. My name is Amin. Today I will be covering solving equations involving two radicals. In order to do this, we isolate one radical, square both sides, and simplify. Isolate the other radical, square both sides, simplify, and factor. Set factors to zero, and then check the solutions. So, for example, if we have radical 2x minus 1 minus radical x minus 1 equals 1, our first step is to isolate one radical. We usually want to isolate the bigger, more difficult radical. So we isolate radical 2x minus 1. Second step is to square both sides. Then we simplify a little, and our third step is going to be to isolate one of the radicals, this radical. After squaring both sides, we're going to get x squared minus 2x plus 1 equals 4 times x minus 1 and then simplifying we're going to get x squared minus 2x plus 1 equals 4x minus 4 which gives us x squared minus 6x plus 5 equals 0 then factoring out we get x minus 5 times x minus 1 equals zero. And then the fourth step, setting everything to zero, setting all terms to zero, gives us x equals five and x equals one. So x equals five or one. And then we check our solutions and this will clearly hold because 1 equals 1. This 2 holds because radical 9 is just 3, radical 4 is just 2, so 3 minus 2 equals 1. And if we have 3 or 4 or more radicals, we just use the same procedure. We isolate one of the radicals, square both sides, then we're left with one less radical, and then we isolate another radical, square both sides, we're left with even less uh, radicals, and then we just continue the procedure until, until we're left with one radical, and then we just solve the equation for one radical. Thank you for visiting the NJIT website. If you need further assistance, Stop by the Cape, Griffin Hall, room 200. Good luck in your studies.